What's going on, guys? I'm back with another one. Here we got WAC 100 speaking on John ja Morant. So John ja Morant was caught again on IG, live with the pistol in his hand. This ain't the first. It don't look like it's going to be nowhere near the last. He keeps getting caught out there anyway. Um, WAC 100 going to speak on it. So we're going to listen in on that, see what he got to say about this. Shout out to WAC 100. Shout out to Clubhouse TV. Let's go. Cause you give these young motherfuckers a lot of money and all that shit all at once, and they they just lose their damn the contract reads, though. It's a lot of shit they can't do. They can't go jet skiing. They can't <clears throat> rob motorcycles. A lot of shit they can't do. Dude just don't give a fuck. Ah, fair enough. Yeah, it's a lot of shit in that thing they cannot do, nigga. Straight up. So he just doesn't care. Yeah, he doing a bunch of wild dumb shit. Well, nigga, remind me of a little rapper. Nigga broke one day, get some money the next, lose his motherfucking mind. So, Wack, if you own that team, how many more chances would you give John? Ja? You know, considering that he's a he is a superstar. Oh, I wouldn't give a fuck about what they got going on. I don't give a fuck about him flashing no gun. That's on the NBA to do what they going. I'm gonna ignore it. I don't care about it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hey, I'm gonna be real. I, I care less about the flashing guns. That's on the NBA. That's you know you dealing with you dealing with the the persona of the NBA, bro. Cause what he doing it, it ain't hurting nobody. Do the nigga own a, a legal gun? No one knows. <laughs> Hopefully, you know. You so hope it's legal. Thing, you know what I'm saying? Right. Me personally. But if you own the team. Yeah, you know, I would fuck them out. So the nigga missing practice. You know what I'm saying? I don't give a fuck about it. You know, he, the NBA gonna do with him what they do with him when it comes down to those rules. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, the, t the team owner might not have no say. The, uh, David, uh, the commissioner might do it for him. Yeah, that's what he's doing. Yeah. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't think that's what he did. But he that. ain't like Miss Proctor. Nigga ain't had a fight on the court. He ain't, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, with that organization. But with the NBA, that's a yeah. whole other story. Oh, he, he, violated, story. he violated NBA rules, maybe not team rules. That's yeah, true. that's what he do. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's true. That's actually worse. That's what I said. I, I said, <laughs> I, I just stashed the little nigga till shit die down <laughs> if I was a motherfucking team owner, nigga. He, could, he, he, gets, he starts $200 million next year. But like I said, he playing with Adam Silver, though. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what kind of rules they gave him the first time around with the burner, but I'm pretty sure they're going to they gonna go ahead and try to make, you know what I mean, let him see something this time. They don't like nothing he's doing, all this shit he's doing. <clears throat> Bad videos, look. Standing on top of cars. Hey, even though that's what these niggas doing on the regular, but ain't nobody stupid enough to go live like this nigga. Some straight jungle shit. But I don't think these young cat these young cats know anything know any different. I don't think they know about you know keep your dirt quiet. I don't think they know about that shit. I think they grew up with the, so everything being seen all the time. So maybe they don't know that there is a private life. They got new technology than what we had started with. How many of y'all glad social media wasn't around when y'all were young? Everybody wanted to hear what Stephen A. said. I want to hear that. I want to play that content. Need a franchise in jeopardy. Your future endorsement and opportunities in jeopardy months ago, not years ago, months ago. And the NBA called you up to the league office the day you spoke to him. You sat down with Adam Silver and he said, "Yo, what you doing here? Let's make sure we 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 don't do this again." And here we are in the off season, and you're doing that. And here's the crime with all of this, because Will Bond, I'm gonna bring this up. Understand right now, we the villains. You the villain, Jalen. You the villain, Will Bond. I'm the villain. 
Why? Because we're sitting up there and we're saying, excuse me, be careful. You got a whole future. Your future is yours. It's the world is yours. Man, we're looking out for brothers. We're trying to tell them, listen, watch it. Watch. The power of choice is a very, very powerful thing. Make sure you choose carefully who you have around you, who's going to safeguard you, who's going to help you protect you by making sure you avoid the things that you need to avoid. And by us looking out and trying to help out, we're villainized because we are willing to tell you the truth. That's the world he's living in. That's the world a lot of these guys are living in. Because God forbid that somebody tells you the truth so you can shield yourself from a, so you can avoid the kind of things that will find us on national television talking about you in this way. Second gun issue? Why are you walking around with a gun in broad daylight? What kind of life are you living? Who are you hanging around? What are you subjecting yourself to that you got to worry about what the hell is going on in your life? These are legitimate questions to be asked. It doesn't make us the villain. We're trying to look out. He just doesn't want to listen. And I find it, I find it a bit co more than coincidental that the not listening part has kicked in after you got five years, potentially $231 million guaranteed. When you were looking for the bag, we didn't hear about this. Once you got it, now we see it on video. Not once, but twice. Come on, y'all. Come on. Stephen A and me since in a long time. It made a little bit of sense right there. Giant learning, bro. I wonder why niggas are always around and recording this shit. What you mean? They want to be seen with it. That's crazy. Uh, why are them niggas full of weeds pulling them phones out? Well, it looked like the way he was standing on top of the car, he told the nigga go live up. So, ain't no fucking telling. Jaja, chill, wild. I don't feel sorry, man. <clears throat> Hope they send him back to the project for seven dollars and to get smoked in nine months. Fuck you. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> man. Yeah, that's how he's behaving now. I mean, bro, look, come on, my nigga. Like, nigga, you didn't made it out, nigga. That's what you doing? Fuck, dude. You don't give a fuck. Why should we? That's a fact. <laughs> Shit, it's probably looking like he acted. He be acting brand new too to the bread. Be all on the sideline, extra down. The fuck, why should you do the fuck shit? And you know he's not from the hood. He's from a really nice home in a nice little suburban area. Oh, it's a bozo. Yeah, that's right. That is. <laughs> he true. is from a well, really nice home in a really nice suburban like, area. Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys, we're gonna leave that one right there. I mean, that was uh, their take on it. How they felt about that. I mean, yeah, it's true though, man. He ain't hood. He ain't from that. Like, he had a good upbringing. That's so stupid. Like, that's some backwards kind of moving kind of thing. You know what I'm saying? If you ain't about that, why are you doing that? Just to act hood? Like, that's not your life. Why you want to make that your life? You know what I'm saying? Love what you do and do what you love, man. Do your ball, man. That's what you're good at. That's what you're best at. You know what I'm saying? I don't know all the things you're good at. I'm just saying that's what you're best at. Shine on that, man. Don't be waving no pistols on IG. Who you doing that for? Who you doing that for? A real gangster at the end of the day ain't going to show everything that he got. You know what I'm saying? You do stuff out there like that, you get caught up. Just the way he's gotten caught up a couple of times already. But anyway, guys, y'all let me know how y'all feel about this one in the comments down below. Until next time, guys, be good, be safe, peace.